got a summons today. I woke up after I did an amazing talk with you guys, and I was told that a white, unmarked van was coming to see me. And I have something to go to court for. So I'm going to ask this officer to identify himself before he summons me, and he'll know. Yeah, at this point in the video, he's talking on his uh, walkie-talkie. He's standing there intimidated to come and see me because he realizes I'm videotaping him right now. Okay, you can tell me. This has to be the part of your job you don't like. <laughs> I believe it, officer. Um, I'm doing this for myself just as well as I am with you. Um, thank you, officer. With, uh, let's, be, uh, let's be known to this officer as well has made an attempt to be a remember what we're talking about, please. This is a firearms prohibition order for you. Absolutely. You have masked away on. And it is written in the right way. It is written in the Look way. at that, people. Dated the first day of February 2010. <clears throat> because of the Controlled Drugs and Substance Act, uh, you are prohibited from any firearm, crossbow, restrictive weapon, ammunition, explosive substance for a period of 10 years. Yeah, I got seven left. You understand that? Absolutely. But that, I got a question, though. It's actually uh, an interesting one. Here's your document. Um, does um, a paintball gun, like uh, extracurriculars and things of that nature, would that qualify as a weapon? Yeah, it could. It could. So I've heard some better people counsel that. Thank you, officer. Um, do I have to be present for anything, or is this just something to tell me to be there? I'll read it. Well, no. Thank you for your time. Stayed, did what he had to do, and did not want to stay any longer. And, well, I won't lie, he did everything he could to show me every piece of identification he had on him. Uh, for some reason, I'm having a hard time upla uploading the video directly from the phone to YouTube. But uh, it was an interesting uh, event, nonetheless, considering uh, we had an amazing discussion yesterday on the Tiny Chat, and I all of a sudden get this crazy little knock on my door reminding me that I can't have any explosive substances. <laughs> for growing a little bit of marijuana. Um, but uh, one of the big things that I noticed about all of this was that I think we're under their skin just a little bit because I actually took the time to read the document that he handed me. And ladies and gentlemen of the world, I already have that document. I was given that document on the day that I was sentenced by the judge. Without exaggerating the fact, there was no reason to come to the door today. <laughs> I already had it all. But I guess they just want to, you know, poke and say hello, remind me that they were still there. But it was fun nonetheless.